How's it going, everybody? And welcome back to another tier list. It's a tier list. Part two. <laughs> <laughs> we're back with another one, and this time we're going to be doing the survivors. So which survivor is going to be the best partner for you? We have different parameters this time around. So the first one, attractiveness. Which survivor looks the best? Pretty straightforward. Will they provide for you? Similar to the killer one, but in this instance, it's more financially, as well as holding their own weight in the relationship. Lastly, it is to do with entertainment. Obviously, in a relationship, it cannot be bland and boring. We don't want none of that. It has to be fun. There has to be something that you can bond over, basically. So without further ado, here we ado again. So let's start with Yui. For me, Yui is A tier. I think she's pretty attractive. She got it going on, right? Yeah, Chris agrees. Uh, in terms of being able to provide, she makes bank with the motorcycle races. So she, she will definitely provide. And entertainment wise, she rides a motorcycle professionally. How is that not fun? She'll just take you for a ride whenever you're bored. That's why I think she's S tier because I see absolutely zero fucking downsides to her. Look at her. She is gorgeous. She makes bank because she keeps on winning. She keeps on getting them sponsors. She keeps on getting them fans. And also, like Karen alluded to, she's just fucking, she, she races for a living. How is that not entertaining? S tier. Fine. Fine, you can have her at S tier. Do I do Quentin? Get him out the way. <laughs> <laughs> Get him out the way. Quentin, for me, would be in C tier. I don't think he's completely unattractive. That's entirely my opinion. He's not 100% my type, but I can I can see his appeal. Providing wise, I I don't know what he does for he's a living. He's a teenager, he doesn't do anything. He's a teenager, he doesn't do anything. There we go, also that's illegal, so I'd rather not. I guess entertainment, like he'll stay up late at night with you a lot because he stays up Doing heroin. Lot. He doesn't do heroin. Nah. He doesn't do heroin. He looks like it. Right, because he's staying awake a lot to try and not get killed by Freddy. Okay. Yeah. No, I'm sorry. He's in fucking. He's he's D tier. He's -tier. ugly as shit. He's not ugly. You're the only person I know who doesn't think he's fugly. Which is why he's C tier. No, I no, I cannot. If you can give me a single benefit of Quentin being your partner, I will allow him to stay in Seeker. He is very well read on dreams and lucid dreaming, which is such a big thing to me. I love dreams. For me personally, he's C tier because I like dreaming. So for me, he would be a good partner because I would wake up and he'd immediately be like, What did you dream? Tell me. Was Freddy there? I'm gonna punch him in the face if he was there. Okay, I'm gonna let him stay there. But he's staying at the bottom of C tier. There's no way in hell anybody gets below him on C tier. Okay. 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 Let's do Ace. No, what? Excuse me? Are you taking the absolute piss? You're, you're, ta you're taking the piss. You're just trying to wind me up. Yeah. Explain yourself. <laughs> Go on. I'm waiting. Ace is not attractive. Let's be real. He's not an attractive man. You think he's oh dear? He's not an attractive man. I don't like Ace. I don't think he's attractive. I'm sorry. He looks like your middle-aged weird uncle that looks at you funny at family gatherings. That's the, that's what he looks like. Listen, I like right? Him. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna argue with you and say that he's the most attractive man on the planet because he's fucking not. But he's got swag. He's got style. All right, you know the man knows how to fucking dress himself. Okay, not really. man wears suits. I he, mean, yes, he with a fucking, yes, like a does. baseball cap and doesn't shave, he doesn't take care of his hair, he looks like a fucking homeless man who just found a suit in the garbage can. He's a little bit of an alcoholic, but it's fine. <laughs> so you're saying that's better over Quentin who... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody can agree besides you. No, I disagree. That, that Ace can agree. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. Ace is more attractive than Quentin. No! All right. Let's put a pin in that. <laughs> right. Put it in that and put it to the side. Can he provide for you? No. Not really, because he's in crippling debt. Yes. <laughs> Entertainment-wise, though. Okay. Entertainment-wise, I'll give it to you that he does seem like a funny dude. He's very resourceful, and I feel like he could make he's you He's resourceful. Laugh. He's okay. charming. Listen, talk. he's Argentinian. That in and uh -huh, of itself uh -huh. should probably... Okay, fine. There we go. That's 
more like it. Right, but oh. he's still not getting any higher than that. He's right? above Quentin, that's all I care about. All right. Let's do, let's do Bill. As much of a hatred I have for Bill Mains because I've been massacred by them <laughs> yeah. as a survivor, I am going to have to put him in B tier. Oh, I put him in A tier. Okay, go so, on, explain yourself. He's a tad yeah. old for me, but Very. if I was an old lady, I would see the appeal. I would. He, he's not an unattractive old man. Yeah. Let's leave it at that. I'm not going to get too deep into that because I don't want that hanging over my head. <laughs> He's got that attitude, which I think is very attractive. It's that confidence and that... Brooding. Yeah, kind of like mysterious badass kind of side to him that I think is very attractive. Yeah. Can he provide? I don't think he might be able to provide in terms of paying for stuff, but he'll definitely be able to provide because he's resourceful. He was in the army. You might not live in luxury, but he'll take care of you for sure. Entertainment-wise, though, that's why he's not an S tier for me, is the fact that he's a very serious man. Wait, hold, what? No, the reason he's not in fucking A tier for me, because I put him in B tier, is because of attractiveness, and that's pretty much it. Do you know how many fucking war stories he can tell you? That'd be awesome. But he's just gonna be like your grandpa at that point. I don't think... Like, it's nice to hear a couple of war stories from your granddad every once in a while, but I think if you are his partner, it would get a little boring after a while. I feel like he'd just retell uh, the same okay. stories over Maybe. and over. Yeah. He does seem to be reliving his glory days quite a bit. Okay, put him in B tier. Put him in B tier. Okay, uh, let's do Zarina. So, Zarina for me is in D tier. I know that might be controversial, but listen. I personally am not very attracted to her. She's not really my type. If she can provide, I don't really think that she's raking in the cash at the moment. And then finally, entertainment-wise, I feel like it's a similar case to Bill. Like, she would just be constantly talking about her job, and she's just married to her job. She's just always going to be talking about the current case that she's working on, and it's just, it'll get to a point where you just want to talk about something else. So, for me, that yeah. just really plummets her. I don't, I don't see anything going for her in that sense, you know? Attractiveness, I think she's beautiful. I don't know what you're not seeing in her. I don't like her hairstyle. I, I Legitimately, I think it's like 90% That her can be hairstyle. changed! <laughs> that can be changed! She doesn't have many nice hairstyles, though. Okay, fine. Fine, 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 fine. She can be at the top of C tier. I mm -hmm. think she should be at the top of B tier because okay. she's beautiful. I do think that unless she really takes off, money's gonna be tight and she's definitely going to be married to her job. So I think, okay, uh, yeah. Mm. The only reason really that you would put her in B tier would I... be because you think she's gorgeous. I don't think she's very pretty. So I think C is a good middle ground. Yeah. I do think she beats Ace and Quentin though. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. How about we go with... Let's go Nia. We'll drop her anywhere for now and we'll okay. see where, where we'll go. So Nia. Attractiveness. No. <laughs> provide it's a, it's similar mm. to bill in the sense that she's not gonna provide with like a good income but she's very resourceful she's she's just a teenager though i'm pretty sure early early 20s late teens i don't think she can provide either and as far as entertainment again just that i think actually i think we have our first contestant for d tier yeah she's, she's just unanimously d tier i do think so yeah it's a shame let's do lnd LED. Okay. Dunning. So dunning. So in terms of providing, um, but first of all, she's got a rich ass family. So that that's a start. <laughs> Isn't she uh, like a curator or something? Like she's got like a- Yeah, exactly. She has a proper job. Proper job. Where she racks in the cash. She loves what she does. And, and yeah. in terms of entertainment- She loves an adventure. She'll take you on her loves fucking an adventure. findings of like archaeology or something. In terms yeah. of entertainment, I feel like she loves an adventure. You know, Absolutely. She, she loves exploring and, and looking for artifacts and shit. I feel like that would be hella fun. That's it. She's just she's just up and S tier with Yui because she's top of the food chain. Hell yeah, absolutely. All right, let's get into one that's gonna cause a fight. Oh dear. <laughs> let's go with Cheryl Mason. <laughs> at that. That. Ah ba ba. Ah. Ah 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 ah. Da 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 da. No no. There yeah there we go yeah. And I will let you explain why, and I will tell you why you're wrong, and she can't go any higher than that. First of all, she's fucking gorgeous. Bite me. I will- I will punch Life. you- I will punch you in the face. I will fly Life. to Ireland, and I will punch you in your smelly, smelly Irish face. You think face. that Cheryl is gorgeous she and Zarina is so beautiful. I- look, okay, I have the same thing that I do with Quentin. For some reason, I like people who look like they're tired as fuck. I don't know why, 
but that's just a thing for me, okay? I think she's very pretty. I love her fucking hairstyle. Like, oh my God, I wish I could pull that off. In terms of being able to provide, I don't think she can because I don't know if she works. I don't nope, think she has a job. And um, in terms of entertainment, she seems she can, absolutely she can, traumatized. Yeah, exactly. I was just gonna say she can entertain you with all the things that traumatized her yeah. severely. So, okay, C tier is fine, but I well, kind of want to be in a shop with C tier because she's a queen. No. But she's definitely Absolutely higher than not. Quentin and Ace, though. No, she's not. I, I'll let her go higher than Quentin, but not Ace, because Ace has the entertainment yeah, factor in terms of charm okay, fine. and talking. There fine. We go. Uh, yeah. Let's do, let's Who, do Jake. Uh, Jake, in terms of attractiveness, is okay. He's, he's okay. Ugly, yeah, he's not bad. Not but bad. he ain't any winning any modeling awards. Let's just say that. <laughs> all right. Clearly, very strong dude. If you like, look at him. In terms of providing for you, he's the. He's resourceful again because he lives on his own in like the middle of the forest. He chose to live off the grid and yeah. turn away from his rich ass family. Yeah. Uh, because he wasn't excelling academically. He's having yeah. a buy, which is good. In terms of entertainment, he seems like a I'm... fun guy. I don't think I don't know him that personally. You know, I I haven't met him yet. You know, he, he seems like, does he know how to juggle? Can he tell jokes? Is he ticklish? Know. You know, there, there's so many things about him I want to know, but I just don't. So he's just kind it, of in the middle, really. It's a question mark. Yeah, everything's just mediocre. I feel like yeah. we should use Jake as base. So Jake is like average in everything. So he's in the he's middle. Hard. So yeah, he's just there. Let's do David. Okay. I, I'm hmm. going to put him, listen, I'm going to put him in A tier. Now listen, right? Okay. Physically, not my type again, but he He's he is objectively a good looking lad. He's got that confidence about him, that swag, if you will. In terms of provide, he is also part of a rich AF family who just K all of his things. Yeah. So if you're into that sugar daddy lifestyle, Okay, but there is there is the question mark over his um, behavior, which I suppose can run into the entertainment, ignoring the illegal activities like we did with Yui. Then, yeah. honestly, David's pretty high up there. Yeah, he's just not an S tier, I think, mostly because of the fact that technically he's not the one providing. I think he, it's just kind yeah. of leeching off of his family. He, yeah, yeah, I think I think he's fine where he is. I think he's fine where he is. I think that's a good place for him. Uh, let's go with Claudette. I want to say A tier as well. Okay. I personally don't think she's very attractive. That's just me. Same. Personally, not my type, Claudette. I'm so sorry. She's adorable, though. Yeah. Like, I love the fuck out of her. In terms of providing, she is really smart. She's she a she professional a lady, and I respect Hell that. Yeah. And in terms of entertainment, I mean, look, this is just me. I love learning new things about the world that surrounds me. And she knows a shitload about plants, which I've always wanted to know more about. So for me, she would be hella entertaining because I would just go out into the garden with her and she'd just be like, this is a thingamajig and that's a th thingamabob. And I'm just like, oh my God, this is so fascinating. I would have the best time with her. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it would be it would be very interesting, but I don't know. I, I think like Bill, it would get stale after a while. Not for me. I would love it. I think I think she's B tier. Okay, we'll leave her there for now because I do think the professional side of things, and she's not she's not entirely unattractive. I do want to say she's not Nia. No one's no, Nia. No, she's no, <laughs> she's definitely no, no not. Nia. I still think she's more attractive than uh, fucking Ace, for example. So she does have to be higher for me. In fact, if I think about it, I think she might even be more attractive than Jake. I don't think she's super unattractive. I think she's yeah, she's good where she is. I like I like where she is because she's got the last two at least for me. She's got it absolutely going. She's got a career right, okay. or at we'll, least we'll in the works. We'll keep her where he is. Okay. We'll keep her where she is because I do think that you'll get tired of her eventually because I won't. of the. You know, I love plants. Or... All right, well, other people will get tired of her eventually. That is, again, that's a very subjective thing. For me, she would be the top of A tier, but because you don't like that aspect, she would. I would push her at the bottom just for you. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, fine. Uh, let's go with Adam. 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 Ooh, okay. Okay, he do be a good looking man. Good looking man. He do be a good looking man. He is a professional man, very professional. smart man. And that yeah, ties boy. into entertainment because he's very smart. He knows, you, you would talk with him about everything. Mm -hmm. Imagine the conversations you would have with this man. Smart lad, mm -hmm. he's, got, he's got the stable job TM. You know, he's good with kids, that's important. Good with kids, yeah, no, um, and also I wanna just, this is a very, again, biased thing. 
I've always wanted to learn Japanese, so <laughs> he kind of gets extra points because he speaks the language and he'd be able to teach me. Entertainment-wise, um, I guess he's... Mm, I'm not sure. What, what, what would he give entertainment-wise? Well, that's, that's kind of the same as Elodie and, and Claudette for me, to be fair. It's, and it's just, just knowing a lot about the field of research that they're in. Because, like, I think it was Adam was into literature. I've always wanted to get more into books. We could read something together. I think that reading something with someone gives me more of a push to read the thing. I'm going to have to say, given the people we've yet to go through, given the fact that we can't really put a pin on how entertaining he would be and how we'd vibe with him he'd have to go top of air here okay that makes sense that's fine let's do meg meg megatron megalodon <laughs> where the fuck are you going attractiveness i don't think she's nia <laughs> nobody's nia we've got this already. nobody but i think she... she's gonna be the only one in teacher i'm gonna call it <laughs> i mean probably okay listen right use jake is she more attractive than jake yes no i think she's more attractive than jake look i have a thing for no. redheads chris i don't know what to tell you all right okay is she going to provide more for you than jake she literally dropped out of college to care for her sick mother she is going to provide no matter what it takes oh well, she dropped out of the chance to have a career and now has no money and no job and no money to pay for college physically i do think she is more attractive than jake in terms of being able to provide, okay, maybe less so than Jake because she gave up a chance at college. Entertainment wise, I mean, she is a sporty lass, so I guess. Yeah, sport. That's entertainment. That for would some be people, more right? entertaining. I kind of want to. I feel like Meg is more my type than Jake. I don't know. It's. Don't, okay, how about kind of on top the same of B tier? Top of B tier? Yeah, okay. Top okay, of okay, okay. Fair enough. That works, I think. That does work. That does work. Top of B tier is good. Let's go with Lori. C tier? Top, top of C tier for me. Top of C tier. Attractiveness? Not really my type. She's okay. No, she's all right. She's all right. In terms of being able to provide, isn't she like a high school student as well? Yeah. Yeah, and then in terms of entertainment... Her own backstory described her as being mediocre. <laughs> really? Okay. <laughs> like, literally, literally just basic bitch teenager. <laughs> Cheryl and Quentin are more attractive. I think Zarina's more attractive than her. Actually, you know what? Zarina's way. Zarina's more know. attractive than fucking half the people above her. There we go. Is that good? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alrighty. She's good where she is. All right, cool, cool. Let's do Tap. Detective Tapparino. Detective Tapparini. Is he attractive? Not really. He's your typical really. middle-aged guy. Can he provide for you? Yeah. I yeah, mean, he has a stable job. Up. In his backstory, he said it does say that he becomes very obsessed with it. To the point where that I think true. he's not... No, like, okay. I don't know if he gets fired or something, and he keeps working on it anyway. Listen, right? He gets obsessed with this one job in particular. But because of that one job, he gets sent to the entities realm because he actually ends up getting killed. So, yeah. at the same time, that job doesn't happen if he's still alive and he's your partner. Okay, assuming that he doesn't get killed and he's my partner, doesn't mean he wouldn't still become obsessed with it, though. Obsession is not good. Is Listen, right? It'll pay the bills. It'll be fine. Yeah, but I want a partner that will also pay attention to me and not will get home Absolutely. from work and immediately so start that... working on the case again. So that really lowers yeah. it for me, like a nice amount. So that would damage the entertainment part, yeah. Yeah, so all he has going for him is he's he's a, he's a he has a job. So above, above, above Jake? Above all the teenagers. <laughs> I would say above Jake. No, Jake has so Why? much more going. Like Jake is, is again, he's the middleman, right? I don't want Tap to be above Jake. In any case, below. Bottom of okay, B tier. Okay, fine. Bottom of Bottom B tier. Of B -tier that's... Okay. I feel like Serena feel like, well? should be higher than Tap though. This is what I was saying. Okay, fine. Okay, 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 okay. You know what? There you go. You have that and that. Is, is that better? Yes. You happy with that? Okay. So Zarina is now bottom of B tier. We got tap at the top of C tier. All right. Okay. Let's start another one that's gonna fucking start a fight. Oh god. Dwight. <laughs> Fuck no. <laughs> Fuck right off. What? No. I'm kidding. Are I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yes, I am kidding. I am kidding. Oh my days. Uh, use use Chris! logic now. Ig ignore your Chris! feelings and your heart and use your brain. My heart says top of S tier just because I would wed the fuck out of Dwight. Listen to me. I'm putting him there just so I can talk with my hands. Chill. Calm thyself. Pun I intended. <laughs> 
In my little silly heart, Dwight is top of S tier because I love him so much. I am very into nerdy guys and I don't know why, but Dwight is like the hottest survivor for me. Like legitimately, out of every single male character in this goddamn game, and yes, I do mean also Felix, I think Dwight is so much more attractive than any other survivor. Because Dwight is my type, okay? To me, he is the most attractive survivor, okay? In terms of being able to provide, he has had so many jobs. He works places, he has a job. Sure, it's a pretty shitty job, but he has one. And he's been a pizza man, he's been a mechanic. Shut up, he's had jobs before, right? And he has one at the moment. Entertainment wise is I think the only place where, okay, he does take a hit because he does seem a little bland. He does seem like, what, what does he do? That's what he seems. There's not enough information about him. Clearly he's not the most charismatic dude or fun guy because he gets bullied by his own fucking co-workers. So clearly there's I something they're lacking. I cannot believe that I have to fucking, ugh. You've heard me, now you go. Why is he lower for you? Because thinking about it, he's not, and I hate it. He's not lower, and I hate it. Right, well look, you did this to me with Bubba, so you're gonna have to fucking suck it. Now, I, me I meant suck it up, but you're I gonna have to suck it as well. I think, I think he has to stay where he is. I think, I think. No! Higher! He's, he's higher! Fucking texture, higher! Higher! Listen, higher! Listen, Tio, Tio Cruz, Lax. He's staying where he is because he's not more attractive than Zarina. Absolutely fucking not. He has about as much income as Zarina. A little bit higher? No. But he has income! So does Zarina. He's staying where he is no matter how much your heart wants him to go forward and reach the heights that you want him to reach. He is unquestionably mediocre. He's... Okay. Yes. I need a minute to be angry at this before we move on. Nancy. <laughs> Nancy to me is bottom of A tier because she's okay physically. She's not the most attractive in my opinion. In terms of being able to provide, she has a job. She's a journalist. I think so, yeah, a reporter. A reporter, that's it, she's a reporter. So she has an income, plenty of, of room for growth in that as well. Yeah. And in terms of entertainment is I think where she lacks a bit because she doesn't seem to be super fun. I haven't watched the show and nothing in her backstory says anything about her being entertaining. Yeah, no, she's not. No. So, so either bottom, yeah, bottom of A tier or top of B tier, your choice. Okay, well see, okay. What does she have over Meg? I would say she's better looking than Meg, personally. E on par, know, but sli debatable. slightly better, I would think, personally. Way better income than yeah, Meg, because Meg has way. none. And entertainment, why is she lax? It lacks in entertainment. Okay, so she's kind of so, in the same level. As neck Meg. and neck with Meg. Neck and neck with Meg. All right, let's do, let's do Jane. Next. Jane, Jane Romero. Nope. Jane, Jane Romero. Okay, so Jane for me, top of A tier. Attractive as hell. Hell yeah. Not talking more about that. There's no need. Everyone knows this. She is a reporter. She's a journalist as well. She is. And a talk show host. Very, very. Yeah, she's a very successful uh, talk show, show ho host. Yeah. Make him back. The reason why she's an A tier for me is that I don't know if she would be actually like, I know that she's a talk show host and stuff, but in her personal life, is she actually entertaining? I think that she would be because in order to be a talk show host and in order to be on radio and stuff like that, you have to have a certain amount of charisma and you just have to be able to ooze confidence and be able to entertain people. That's fair. Like to have a show that people want to watch, you have to be entertaining. I think she's fine where she is for now. Okay. Just because, yes, very charismatic. You have to have those attributes in order to have the talk show to make it successful. You need yeah. to be entertaining. However, I feel like even though she has that star power, she lacks the adventure and the spark that Yui, Elodie, and some of the others to come do. Yeah, okay, I agree with that. I do think uh, that from her backstory, she does lack a lot of that confidence and adventurous quality that, yeah, that the first two have for sure. All right, yeah, top of A tier, I think she's she, she looks pretty good there. Alrighty, next one. Let's go with Ash. 
Ash just seems like a bit of a dick. <laughs> oh, a hundred percent. I don't think he's attractive. I don't like him. Nope. Given the fact that he is not very attractive, he's most likely just an asshole as well, which is not very good. And the yep, fact that can he provide? He's like, what does he do? He just kills things. I don't know. For a living, he just like, does kills he things. get paid for it? Like, I've never watched his show. Nope. He's just a bit of a manslaughter. Right, and entertainment-wise, yeah, he's very charismatic, so he does that go- has uh, you, that You going can on. give him that, but he's- But I'd say he's bottom of B tier or top of C tier, I do not want to put him Yeah, on again, that. just give it the same treatment as we did Meg. Is he more attractive than Jake? No. No. Can he provide more for you than Jake can? Probably no. not. Can he entertain you more than Jake? Yes. Maybe, because of the Is charismatic. It? Bottom of B tier, even I don't think he should even be top, higher than Dwight. Top C tier, top C tier. Top C tier, all right. That, that's fine, that's fine by me. There you go. All right, let's do, let's do Jeff. Yeah. A tier? Huh? Let's talk it out. Not my type, I don't think he's very attractive, but he can provide, he's got a job, and he seems okay. like a very chill dude. He can entertain. I'm pretty sure he's into he like is. music and stuff. Like he, he is. he's like a he's musician. Into... Yeah. Yeah. So he's got two he's things going for him. It's just really yeah. the fact that he looks mm. a bit like a caveman. Yeah. I mean, I guess. Like aside from the fact that, okay, physically he's not Dwight. <laughs> Again, like attractiveness is the most subjective thing that we're talking about here. Yeah. Jeff is not my type, but he's extremely I... entertaining he's very kind he can provide for you because he, he does art i love that i cannot i cannot disagree i cannot make a case for him to go, be go below nancy because he's about on the same level as attractive as nancy he's got probably the same income as nancy and he's just a lot more entertaining and a lot more interesting than Nancy is. Quite a bit more, yeah, definitely. Would you put him higher? Put him above Bardet. All right, why? Well, first of all, let's just go between me and you. Yeah, he can that entertain- That appeals more to both of us. Yeah, the... More than Claudette does, okay, because the, the, the bottom side of hers is better to you. Yeah. But if you take that into a wider uh, audience, then he's even more entertaining to more people rather than Claudette, because again, okay. that's a very yeah, niche- Yeah, very niche. Yeah, yeah. You're right, you're right. Okay, okay, that, that, that makes sense. All right, we can leave him there. Felix. Has to. Felix. Absolutely. There's Absolutely. Ab I mean, Let's look, look at, at him. him. Look Another... at his bank account <laughs> and look at the destinations he's been. Right. No, he's definitely a very interesting guy. He's okay. So him and Elodie know, like they know each other in yes. their, their backstories. Yes, so they, and they were kind of part of the same group of sort of outcasts and stuff. Yeah. So he They're, kind of has of going for him. Right. Same time. They, oh yeah, no, they have a lot, they, they have kind of the same going for them. They're both, I think, equally as attractive, to be fair, in their own rights. They are both very successful in their fields. They're very yeah. interesting people. Uh, yeah. And I don't know, I feel like they exude that level of confidence that I think is very attractive. So, pretty much. There we go. That's it. That's he's it. Just, he's just up there. No, he's just up there now, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, let's go with Fang. Fang. I'm gonna talk about it without releasing her for a moment. So, okay. In terms of attractiveness, not with that hairstyle, but with any other hairstyle that she has, I think she might be S tier level of attractiveness for me. I politely disagree. <laughs> I don't care. This is me talking right now. <laughs> I think she is quite attractive if she changes her hair. Um, in okay. terms of being able to provide, she can't. She was making quite a bit of money because she was into esports, e she was winning, she was That's doing right. very well, right. but then she got into crippling death and spent her nights in bars because she can't win anymore. Right, okay, so addiction, that's not very good. And, I mean, entertainment-wise... Yeah, absolutely, entertainment-wise, at least for probably everyone watching this video right now, is a big plus. <laughs> Uh, yeah, because she's she's a gamer girl. I'm gonna put the her then at the bottom of A tier because no. Okay, top of B tier. No, again, back to Jake. Top is she more attractive yes. to Jake? I think not. Personally, I don't think so. Okay. She cannot provide more than Jake can. In fact, you're gonna have to fucking cater to her. And entertainment-wise, okay, yeah, she beats out Jake. To be fair, because Quite they play fucking video games. 
That's right. pretty awesome. Okay, top of C tier then. Top of C tier. It doesn't make up. It doesn't make up for. No, I genuinely category. I do think she's kind of similar in the same sense as like Ace, where her addiction got her to a point where she became yeah, weak, which is yeah. not healthy. So I I do think, but I do think she's much more attractive than Aces and much more entertaining than Aces. So top of C tier. Top of C tier. Top of C tier. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's go with Steeb. Okay, listen, right? You haven't listened, listen to me. You haven't seen the show. You haven't seen the show. So we're not I, going off the show. We're going off the character, and the character's based on the show, so we're going off the show, Chris. Listen, physically, he's not the most attractive, but I think he's he's got that confidence. He's, he's very charismatic. And that hair, though. I think he's very attractive, yeah. okay? Okay. <clears throat> so that's one thing. Can he provide? He is Mr. Scoops Ahoy, of course he can provide. He's raking in all of that part-time job cash. He has a job, at least. But entertainment-wise, he extremely excels. How? Okay, I'll put him there for now. Listen, right? Because he is, he legitimately is the most charismatic dude ever. He's really funny. Oh, thanks. He's, right, we don't have the same comparison here. Because with Scoops, we have the show, which I know you say like we're, gonna we're talking about the show because he's based on the character from the show. He's literally called Steve. Like he's okay. Steve Harrington from Stranger Things. Oh, is so goddamn charismatic. Uh, guys, please help me convince Chris to watch Listen, Stranger Things. Let's just say he's yes. on par with Ace for charismatic because no, you can't. So you, how how the fuck do you know? How the f have you spoken to Ace? Have you seen him interact with people? Have and you on his spoken to image? Ace? No, you haven't. No, I haven't. I I, I haven't, haven't spoken that's to why Steve, but I've seen him assumption. speak. No, no, that's a, no. That's bias for Steve. No, you you can't. You literally cannot compare them because you've so much information on Steve in comparison to Ace. So just make them the same. Put that aside, okay? Can he provide for you? Yes. No. He's got yes, a he has minimum a job. Wage job. <sighs> he has. So I would say he goes above Bill. Bottom of no, A tier. Final offer. Above Meg. He is above Meg. No, just above Meg. <laughs> no, and above Nancy as well. He has so much Nancy has a better job. Yeah, but she's less attractive and less entertaining. Boom, I win. I will fight you to the death. I will give you... Right. Top of B tier is fair. I will, t I will take top of B tier. Okay. I feel he should be higher, but okay. <sighs> blow my nose before we carry on with the charade. Let's go with... Let's go with Kate, because I feel like there's going to be less of a debate about Kate than there will be about Yoongjin. I disagree. I think we're going to have more of an issue with Kate. So... Why? There. Yeah, exactly. Explain. <laughs> She's gorgeous. Yes. One sec. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the reason why she's not an STF for me is being able to provide... She doesn't have, like, a stable kind of job. She moves around a lot. But entertainment-wise, she so makes up for it, more than enough. She is very in tune with nature, she's very chill, she plays the guitar and she sings, very musical based, and that kind of goes hand in hand with Jeff, he's also an artist. She traveled around the country, fucking in a entertaining fucking, people. Yeah, but in like a shitty car, it's just not rich or anything. I think she earns enough to move to the next town. I think she kind of like goes, she plays in bars and stuff, and then she moves to the next place. I think it's kind of like that. Is that it? I think so. It doesn't say anywhere, like it said that she won competitions and stuff, but it doesn't say anywhere that she's like, she's signed or anything, you know? She's very independent, I think. And this isn't like the age of social media, at least it doesn't seem like it. So she's not a TikTok star, right? She's not making bank. At least it doesn't seem like it. I think top of A tier. Yeah, sure. We can, we can keep her top of A tier. That seems to fit just right. Alrighty. Last but not least, Yoon Jin Lee. I think she's uh -huh. A tier. Not sure where, but I do think she's also A tier. Attractiveness. Yes. Good looking, but not stunning. I do think she's attractive, but in any case, she would make up for it in her sense of fashion. She's very fashionable. Not my taste. Okay, so I, 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 I would say she's like. You would say you know, like she's B tier, no... B tier attractiveness, if you will. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would say so. Provide. Now, she does make bank. Oh. She owns the bank. <laughs> she she makes all the money. Yes. Okay? So, no worries there. Entertainment-wise, 
she's completely fucking married to her job and she's a little bit of a bitch so mm-hmm. kind of takes away from it that's a good point all right well where could we put her then b tier i would say top b tier top b tier that's our list that's our list i feel so bad leaving nia in d tier on her own i really? i mean she fucking deserved it she doesn't do anything <laughs> that's awful could i at least bo- put a like bottom of c tier i feel so bad having no that. No, someone has to be there. I'm so sorry, Nia. I'm so sorry, Nia. Entities down at the bottom. (laughs) Right, well. Ta da! That's it. Ta da! Thank you guys for watching. Please let us know. Please give out to us again and come join our Discord. (laughs) Go into the comments. Destroy our choices. I know there's going to be a lot of people angry about Steve and maybe a lot of Nia mains coming out. I'm very angry about Steve. I'm very angry. Justice, (laughs) hashtag justice for Steve. Anyway. Chris did him dirty. Anyway. Anyway. Please give us ideas for yes. another More tier list we can do, either killer or survivor or both. Or both. We can like we do with the partners. Up. Please go like the video. It really, really helps. It pushes us up on the recommendation, so this can be exposed to more people. Yes, and it takes as one well as that. Quick, quick, just a little click. One to little, like. one, 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 little, 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 comment give us all of the ideas for more videos we will always appreciate the feedback oh yeah and yeah hope you enjoyed see you Thank next you time guys bye bye